how you use the audio DACA tool in DaVinci Resolve 19. Let's go! So I have my music on the video track 2 and me talking on video track 1 or audio track 1 and the music is on track 2. And I want to automatically fade in and out the music when I'm start talking and when I'm done talking. So to make this automatically, we will use the audio DACA. You can find it when you go to your track with your music, in my case the second one. Go and click right here and now you can see under audio this tab has opened and here you can enable the DACA. Now we have to tell the DACA from which audio track he should listen and adjust the music to. In my case, audio one, because this is me talking. Here you can adjust the DACA level, so how much your audio will be decreased when a DACA sees you talking. Under advanced control, you can fine tune your DACA audio. Same with this custom button. Here you can fine tune your DACA and save it as a preset for the future. Now, as you can see, when I'm playing, how to set up DaVinci Resolve to do voiceover in the Fairlight page. Let's go! The DACA will automatically adjust the volume and fade in and out your audio only when it's necessary. Something to take care of is even if there is this tiny little bit of audio, the DACA will use this and decrease the music in this part as you can hear. So for the best results, I would recommend to cut out the section where you're not talking and then just decrease the audio completely to zero. And so you got the best possible result. And this is the audio ducker and how you can use it to save yourself a lot of time. Go! Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Like and follow if you want to learn video editing fast.